Hey everybody, it is Jennifer with Magic Monthly and I'm back with Juju Bijou. Hi sweet girl. <laughs> and we are going to be unboxing my fortune cookie soap for August. Awesome, so I went ahead and cut the flaps and I couldn't help but see the label and I was very excited because this is going to be a themed uh, fortune cookie soap and it is Witch Please. And I can tell from the green and from the yellow brick road here um, that we are looking at a Wizard of Oz theme. At least I think. I could be wrong. But I'm pretty sure this is looking like some Wizard of Oz. So it's really nice. I really like the uh, imagery. Super excited. So let's jump right into this box. This box is $16.95 a month. And you are guaranteed, I think, one full size and then deluxe sample sizes. And every three months or every quarter, you get a special themed box, which is what this is. So, which please, the scents and fragrances are on the back, so we'll come back to there. I'm definitely right, it's Wizard of Oz, because the sticker this month says, keep calm and click your heels. So there you go, we got some ruby slippers. So we are definitely Wizard of oz -y. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab the first thing that I see, which is wrapped. And this is gonna be a perfume oil. I get so many perfume oils from Fortune Cookie Soap, I'll never have to buy perfume again. Having said that, I really do wish that they could kind of vary their products a little bit. I love their perfume oils. I'm just way stocked in them right now. So this is called The Shiz, which I think is super funny, um, obviously because Witch Please is punny, and The Shiz is also punny, but also, He's the Wiz and he lives in Oz. So I also think it's a little bit of throwback to the Wiz. It is the Broadway edition of The Wizard of Oz that stars um, Diana Ross. And to be honest, I like it way better. Hmm. That is a good smell. So it says, normally you wouldn't want to smell like shiz. <laughs> but get ready to eat those words. What? It wouldn't be fortune cookie soap without an inappropriate remark or two. A woodland hike through damp balsam woods with top notes of maple leaves blowing through new dawn blossom laurel and sweet clove. I don't know what any of those things are except for the pine. Basalm. But it definitely does smell woodsy. Oh my gosh. I. It makes me so ready for fall. It's not what I'd call a summer fragrance but for fall it is just amazing. It smells like leaves changing and everything. So I really like that a lot. I will put that aside and I will be rocking that come this fall. All right, next we have an OCD hand sanitizer, which I love. I'm still using the hand sanitizer I got last month. And this is called BFFs. And I assume this is referring to uh, the Wizard of Oz gang. And this says, blueberries and pumpkins might be considered an unexpected friendship, but in this unique scent, they're inseparable. Sticky sugared blueberries and luscious baked pumpkin with all the fall spices atop a warm cake accord. So they're definitely going for a fall um, scent palette this month, which is awesome because it will be here before you know it. Mmm, I smell the blueberries. <sighs> Actually, in a bit too much. Whew, that is strong. I definitely smell the blueberries. I'm not quite picking up the pumpkin. Yeah, it's it's so subtle. It does kind of smell like a blueberry pumpkin pie, which you think sounds weird, but actually it's really good. Next we have Swankified. Swankified? Not quite sure what that is referring to. So if you know, let me know. And it says, we're the most swinkified place in this town. Bunches of ripe bananas mashed into sweet sugary cake batter, then topped with walnuts baked to a golden brown. And this is a walnut scrub, which I've gotten a walnut scrub from them before and I loved it. Yeah, that smells like walnuts and cake and cookies and all things amazing. So definitely give that a whirl. Then we have green is the new black. And again, I, I'm picking up like Wizard of Oz and um, Wiz references because in the Wiz, they sing a song, I wouldn't be caught dead, red. And anyway, they go through, they change the color to green and all the things. So if you know the scene that I'm talking about, it's in the Emerald City. What is this? This is whipped cream. Mmm, picking up some kind of interesting smell in there. So it says, because orange would have been too obvious, top notes of orange, apple, pear, pineapple, and cherries lured into autumn by pumpkin, cinnamon, nutmeg, and clove. All rounded out with warm vanilla and few sugar. I'm picking up the clove and the sugar. So let me just give myself a little bit of this whipped cream. It's like their lotion, except it's way good. Ah, oh, that smells like a warm sugar cookie. 
Oh, it's sugar. It's sugar. That feels amazing. Is summer really over already? Like it's the end of August. My birthday is next week, so it's definitely the end of August, and it's just like flown by. Ah. Oh. Oh, I can't wait for fall. I can't wait for Halloween. I just can't wait. So then we also have something on a string. And this is, I have never seen this before. So this is a scent diffuser called Flying Monkeys. And it says, Mischief's in the air, a fruity breezy blend of peach, watermelon, neroli, and jasmine with air and aquatic notes. But the real star of this fragrance, fresh ripe bananas. I looked on the Facebook group and so basically there's a little plastic tab that's on the inside of this. So when you unscrew this, you remove that plastic tab and then you turn it over and you let it soak into the wood, which you can actually see that it is soaking into the wood. Um, and then you hang it up in your car. And so that's how you get the fragrance. So I will put that in my car. It smells really good. So I, I'm excited about, and you can smell it. And it also says anytime you wanna smell extra, just like give it a shake. You can see like how much of it's already soaked into the wood. So now that it's soaked in, I can hang it and whenever I, I need more, I can shake it up again. So that's awesome. I hope they send more fun stuff like that. All right, so last but not least, you get a fortune, an actual fortune cookie soap in every special edition box. I'm getting a nice little um, stack of these now. Some ruby slippers and I am right. So it is a clear, uh, clear soap with red. It's not, it's got glitter in it, but it's not like super, super vibrant. It's not like ruby slipper vibrant, but it's cute. And it does have my fortune inside. So let's check that out. And it says, because I knew you, I have been changed for good. So there you go. And the fragrance is called, There's No Place Like Home. Which is very good. That has a real cinnamon vanilla smell. And let's see, it says, close your eyes and repeat after me, curled Macintosh apple peels, lovingly kissed with a hint of cinnamon. All spice and clove make this fragrance warm and cozy, just like home, as long as home's not in Kansas. Mm. Yeah, that is amazing. So I really love these fortune cookie soaps. I never use them because they're too pretty, but I'm getting a nice little collection. So I'm gonna get a nice dish, soap dish at some point and put those in there. That's it, that's my fortune cookie soap for the month of August. If you're getting this box, let me know what you think of it. It's probably one of my favorites that I've gotten just because the smells are so fall and just wonderful. I'm so ready for fall. How many times am I gonna say fall? All right guys, so I will see you next time. Hope everybody's doing wonderful and enjoy the dog days of summer while they're still here because it is so hot. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.